Hey guys, good long way back. I'm Aaron. I'm Calvin. Rick. Eric. Calvin, we don't have me. So bothered. Calvin, what have you done? His head's not moving. Calvin! What happened last time? Last time we had uh, a fight in a hallway, which was really good. We yeah. met mom, but was not mom. Her name was, I don't know what her name was. We also had a. Grace. Uh, I don't think they ever said it, did they? Grace, he did. I know it was in the subtitles, but I try to ignore that if I can. No, um, he said, see you, Grace. Yeah, we also Grace. had some Greek being yelled at. Good job, Greek. Greek. That's not Greek at all. Mine might be closer to Greek. Yeah, it feel things. real weird if someone's like, actually, balaka licky means ice cream in Greek. Yogurt. Maybe. You know what, buddy? <laughs> a cigarette smoking man. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool. Did you see that? Now he's gotta do his things. <laughs> <laughs> the shapes and scholars. No! No oh, re entry. Maybe this one was this. Is this how he. Maybe they give him the thing that they gave to. Luther? Luther? Yeah. yeah. Uh-uh, 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 I don't care if it is Based on weight. It's okay, Aaron. <laughs> so, that stuff, Look, look, that, it's red. Yeah. It's red. So it made him more human, and it made his son more monkey-like. More ape-like. Yep. It's and like, it's like Vanya stuff. Like the mutagen in Ninja Turtles. So he was reading Aww. in ancient Greek to Pogo, and Pogo taught it. Five? Yeah, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look that! Oh, what? Umbrella so Academy? Sweet, this is an umbrella? Fucking cute. You're too good. You ask too many questions. You know too much. And you fight like you know what you're doing. <laughs> He's got a point. Yeah, so he I does. know how to handle myself, and that makes me the bad guy. Whoever you are, you're in my way. If I see you again, I will kill you. Hmm. Is Harlan just, what's he doing? Mm. Mm. Uh, is Carl back? I think not swimming. Oh shit. Carl's back early. What's that mean? What's that? Eggs. Eggs. Eggs? No, no, no. I don't, I don't understand that he's easy. following me. Wait, who? Those Dutch sociopaths. They're Swedish, you idiot. Alison! Yes, he's back. Baby. <laughs> I'm saying it might not just be his house, it's probably with something else. This place was huge. It's HH, maybe it's Hugh Hefner. I'm your son. No, you're not. But no, I, I'm, I'm, I'm from the future. No, you're not. You adopted me and six other children in 1989. No, I didn't. I, <laughs> I know about the moon base. Uh, I know about all your experiments with monkeys. Apes. I don't know who sent you or what you want. But you can run back to your masters at CIA or KGB and tell them that this is the most ridiculous gambit in spy craft is what? Why? Why is it ridiculous? It's like when Lucas felt reach out to Dave Filoni. Time, time travel isn't the problem. I have a deep dislike of children. Now take yourself and the stench of failure that encircles you and get out of my house. That's pathetic. Oh well. That's pathetic. He didn't shank my ass. No bro. He shanked your heart. <laughs> he shanked your heart. <laughs> Arlen don't care. I just want a kiss. Can't we get to wait till we're alone? No, baby, no, okay. Well, well, you're gonna have to. Carl. Stay out of this one. <laughs> you my wife or not? No, vibration's not. Okay. What the hell was that? That damn bird hit the window. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. Last time I saw this one, she had me suspended midair, sucking the life out of me with energy tentacles. I think I'm a lot of little time. <laughs> it's true. Oh, I would love to see an energy tentacle. I don't remember what I did, but I'm sorry. 
if, if that means anything. Oh my god. <laughs> you didn't want to hear it? Hello? So mean. So drunk. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Finally all together? Yeah, not the bins here. Unfortunately, ghosts can't touch. God damn it. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Poor Ben. He's such a fucker. There's so much cat hair. Are they shaving them? I think they're just getting the place in better order. Is that their mother or something? Yeah. What a climber. So I think we all know what we have to do. Kill Dad. Find Dad. <laughs> yeah. Find Dad. Yeah, but Diego's a kill. None of us are supposed to be here, right? Yeah, but I mean, what if it's us? If they kill Dad, done anything to screw up the timeline? Diego's been stalking Lee Harvey Oswald. And you're working for Jack Ruby. Allison has been very involved in local politics. Okay, you started a cult. Thank you. I'm, I'm just a, a nanny on a farm. I don't have anything to she do with do. all of that. Well, maybe you do. We just don't know it yet. Uh, hmm. Clearly, we were all sent back here for one special reason. Saving Save. John Fitzgerald Kennedy. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Uh, uh, Guys, you all die. I was there. I saw it. I don't know if the things we've experienced here are all connected. I don't know if there's a reason for everything. But Dad will. We need to talk to him before everyone and everything we know is dead. Okay, I'm out. <laughs> no one leaves until we figure this out. Where'd he go? Howie. Why did the monkey learn how to fight dirty? Oh. Whoa, that was quick. Yeah. It was. Maybe it's like the Three Amigos. You don't remember the end of the Three Amigos, do you? No, I remember. Hmm. But that was the same lady. Maybe it wasn't. Maybe it just looked like her. That's the whole point. Don't remember the other three amigos. Huh? I remember. Look at that guy. <laughs> oh. Are you? That guy needs a sandwich. <laughs> he really does. <laughs> Request the pleasure of your company for a light supper on the 20th of November, 1963, half past seven o'clock. Today? 1624 Magnolia Street. Pepper Sippers, a light supper. Up. Uh. Up. Uh. Ooh, whoa! Jeez. It's just a leg. Yep. Diego did this. Now they want revenge. Well, minus one Swede. Mm. Luckily, their nickname doesn't change. It's still the Swedes. This uh, looks like now. the company that was used for Callahan and Tommy Boy. Oh, uh, was it? Yep. I bet you it was the same place. Where was it? Same exterior. In Tommy Boy for Callahan Industries? Or Callahan Automotive? I know this song. This is what oh, this like. is the bad guy song. Isn't oh, it? Oh, shit, yeah, it does, Eric. Yeah, it's the, that one spot there, they yeah. talk there, trucks are pull up there. Tell me, man, it's Tommy Boy. All right. Yeah, I like this better. What the fuck did she do that? 
Does she have teleporting powers too? Maybe. Maybe she's one of How the, the kids. How the fuck is she doing this? Yeah, she has to be teleporting too. I said that she could be one of the kids. Maybe she could be one of the kids. I said that. No, I just said that. I said that. You said that after I just said that. And I said that because you said that. I said that. You said that. You're better than I thought. You were entirely average. You can come out now. The hell is she doing? Well done. What happened to that beer, girl? Oh shit! You caught me naked as a jaybird. Well, you I guess it was bound to happen soon. We meet up. That's all right. You're part of the family. She goes pushing her feelings down again. Honey, wait. Hello. Hmm. Huh? Yeah. Sounds like it. Hello. Oh, song? Okay. No, not that one, Calvin. Hello. Okay, yeah, it's wrong. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> this is a traditional funeral, Aaron. I was confused for a minute. I'm like, what the hell's going on? Okay. Aww. It is this song, but it's in Swedish. I'm going to tell you everything. I like Ray. I hope he accepts. Hello, Swedish cover. Huh? I love seeing the Umbrella Academy come back together and not immediately destroy themselves. That was yeah. nice. Yeah. No, dude, I loved the Vanya, Klaus, and Allison in like the barber shop. in the hair salon, yeah. like yeah. conversation, dancing, and stuff too. Yeah. Like they weren't arguing. Like a lot of last season, was a little bit of social lubrication, well, constant arguing, fighting. No one agreed on anything. Everyone hated each other for. Everybody right. keeping secrets. So, Those three weren't arguing, but Luther was still, like fucking out. I mean, no, but even so, at the end there, the, him and Diego are sitting there talking things out too. And you then know? I like the way that it's like, you know, okay, yeah, this is fucking Luther. It's Dad involved, and he's like, I'm fucking out. He sent me to the moon, you know. Um, so he has his issues, but I like that it wasn't just like them yelling at each other. They seem no, to resolve. They talk. Yeah. And they got this new thing with the light supper. Light supper. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Like, it's like they're having that. To my pursuers, it's so cool. Yeah. So they have a different conversation too going on. Yeah. So it's like they are talking. You know, they're they're conversing about some things, and it's not just like there were all the problems between so many people. Luther and Diego hated each other so much last yeah. season. Yeah. Yeah. So even though so much of this season is kind of. A in a way, it's kind of retreading some of the same. Like they were all apart. They came together for the for the dad dying, and like it, it's getting them together to be one yeah. cohesive unit. And that never really happened until kind of the end. Mm -hmm. Like at least now, like they've kind of gotten a camaraderie built up more so with the help of Vanya for yeah. getting everything. <laughs> that yeah. kind of helped out a bit too, yeah. I think. You know, <laughs> that might be my favorite bit is how they just keep like subtly bringing that up. Yeah, just a little well, it's bit. better than the last relationship, like the serial killer. She's like, what? what? <laughs> That's yeah. so funny. But like with that, like having Luther apologize to her for what he did without actually saying, you know, I'm sorry, I locked you up in a, in a safe. Yeah. <laughs> you know, and like, Vanya apologizing to Diego. And yeah. Being like, yeah, that does help. I I love that moment. She's like, if it means anything, I'm sorry. He's like, it does. He puts his he stops flipping his knife. Yeah. You know, it's great. Yeah, that, was, that was really cool. The, the one thing that's terrible about the family is fucking poor Ben. Who poor like, ben. says he misses him and he wants to be yeah. back into his family and Klaus just fucking fucks No, Ghosts fuck. can't time travel. You fucking ass. Uh, it's funny too because it's the question we asked at the end of last season. Like, can they time travel? Can ghosts do that? And we're like, uh, probably not. Yes, no. And they're here, they're throwing that back in the fans' faces being like, sure, we can use that as an excuse, you know? But, well, he fell through with him. Yeah, he did. But we, I remember at the end of last season, us asking, like, well, if he does, does that mean he can, you know, we didn't see what happened after that, you know? Yeah. yeah. So. Does that person had to have already died yeah. in that world Yeah. in order for him to take that? Can a, or can a spirit without a body travel through anything, you know? Like, or is uh, he more in Klaus rather than yeah. in the world? Anyway, there was all those little questions we had, and then now that we know the answer, they can still play off of that assumption that we didn't know then, so the other characters don't. So, I like the beginning with Pogo. You know, it doesn't play into anything the rest of the episode. I just enjoyed it. 
Yeah, but and it, it makes also, me always sad too because we watched him die last season. It also maybe had some kind of tie to, I guess, what was maybe injected into Luther. Yeah, saving his life. Yeah. yeah, it's also interesting to see him seeming to care about Pogo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I don't think he read his kids any bedtime stories. No, you know? but he also said like he has a distaste for children. Yeah, apes are maybe different. Maybe. I don't know, but whenever he took the kids, he got and it might be too. The ape thing that he was doing with Pogo had a science reasoning behind it, and he seems to be a very science-heavy kind of individual. So the children, maybe he did in a different fashion care about them, but he also had a distaste for children, but there was a science thing of it, so... I also wonder what happens to Grace, too. Like, does he yeah. love her, and she dies, and the only way he can keep her around is not like Pogo, but by making her a robot, and that is breaks he, his connections as well. Yeah, is he responsible for her death somehow? I feel like he's going to be responsible for her death, but he goes back to a likeness of her because mm-hmm. he he remembers that she was the best part yeah. of of that. Like, you know, he was he was reading the bedtime story, yeah. but he also wasn't paying attention to when he fell asleep. Yeah, uh, and then I think we. We had Grace, like Robot Grace, the mother, being like their nurse and person that like put them back together. She's wearing that like really clean like outfit and stuff. And I remember like speculating, oh, okay, he's programmed her to be like the doctor, but she was a legit doctor. Yeah. Uh, some somehow uh, in her real life, so that was cool too. Doctor, biologist, yeah, oh. scientist. So, what do you guys think with Harlan, like quieting? We're recognizing Vanya's, like, outburst. I mean, is it just that, like, Vanya has done that for him? And once Vanya, he can, like, recognize the symptoms of someone, like, not being able to express himself, so then he, like, quiets her? Does that have anything to do with the stuff that she did when she saved his life? Yeah, maybe they have a connection now. Yeah. Yeah. I kind of felt like it was him, like, remembering, maybe not understanding what all happened yeah. but understanding like that that does come from her yeah. and you know he helps her calm down she yeah. helps him calm down kind of thing hmm. that was interesting like you know um, she helps him in not being able to properly express himself he can do the same thing for her that could be cool yep I thought that was really good I like the the fight it was pretty good um, it was a little heavy on the cuts but well, it was heavy on the cuts, and it was really heavy on the stunts, uh, stunties. Yeah. Like, yeah. Uh, number five stunt actor is a man. Yeah, for and, sure. For sure. I mean, <laughs> you know. That's why I think they're heavier on the cuts and a lot of, like, you know, showing the feet yeah. and behind the back yeah. and not, you know, him. Well, and, and also um, they're cutting around the fact that she appears to be teleporting as well. There's something going on with that. Yeah. As I, yeah, I was going to get into whatever's... I don't know what that, that is. However she was able to pop, pop, pop. He said that he recognized, oh, you fight like all the other imbeciles at the, at the commission. Mm-hmm. But, Thrones. Fucking Hazel, when he was fighting, he was just a giant tank fighting other giant tanks. You know, like, I didn't see him do anything like that. Yeah, I don't know. I was thinking, wait, is she, like, traveling through time somehow and appearing there and it's not teleporting? She also, it also seemed like the handler wanted to talk to Five. Yeah. Not, like, she could have killed him probably, you know? Mm-hmm. But he also seemed to know that they're there and it seemed like there's going to be a communication. So maybe they have... I'm sure they have some kind of joint thing where, like, she wants commission back and he's got to stop the commission who the Swedes yeah. are there trying to kill and, you know, something along those lines. What are the Swedes... What was their original mission and why is it now... Well, I mean, their mission Diego. before was just... Well, no. They they got a picture of Vanya. Yeah, got a picture I know. Of, they've gotten pictures of where they are for various yeah. people. So I don't think it's just Diego. It's just, like, here's more information on no, the yeah. next known whereabout of this one. You're looking for this guy at this location. Because I know, I know for sure one of the last ones we got was Vanya being at the house or whatever, and they were yeah, on their way the to conver- her. The conversation that they had while they were all together upstairs, eating the, the weird Jello stuff, was that the commission was sending those guys back yeah. to try to kill them so that they would stop interfering with the timeline, because they were making small changes. They didn't want them to make bigger changes and ruin everything. Mm-hmm. Yeah, which relates to what Vanya said: was how do we know we don't start the apocalypse? Yeah. You know. And also what Diego and Luther were saying is, like, how do we know that trying to stop it is what causes it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, the, the funny thing is, like, man, well, maybe we all have some ties to this, you know? Like, him with Jack Ruby and Allison with the civil rights stuff. Mm-hmm. and Dad you know, on Grassy Knoll. Yeah, the only one that didn't count was Vanya. Like, what if Vanya takes Sissy away from Carl? Carl goes 
crazy, messes up the whole shower industry. Everyone's just dirty, filthy, and hates everybody. They start killing each other. Maybe that's like the bad day. That... Yeah, I don't know. Like, it'd be crazy if that one actually has some real tie. Which is... They just assumed it did, but I was like, no, it doesn't. I don't think. But yeah, yeah, but like, they're, they're assuming the other ones could have some ties. But yeah. they, did, they didn't say Vanya. She's like, well, I'm just at a farm, yeah. you know, doing nothing. But it'd be, it would be very interesting if, out of all of them, that's the one that somehow has the biggest tie to mm -hmm. what's going on. Just because yeah. of Vanya having the apocalypse thing, they're always like, ah, Vanya, and Klaus, you know, this time. Yeah. You know, Vanya, I mean, she, it's what usually happens. Mm -hmm. like, usually. It happened once. Well, <laughs> you know? maybe it's something to do with her giving the power to Harlan. Possibly. The Russians see that and, like, react to it. Maybe. Yeah. I don't know. He did have a, like, a sensing kind of moment or something, didn't he? Yeah, maybe, maybe Carl's a sleeper agent. Ooh, because Carl did, like, look at Vanya for a long time. I was thinking, like, how the hell... Would you connect that broken window with this woman? You know? Unless you knew there was some kind of power thing going on. Maybe. Like, he had, like, this suspicious, like, suspicious like, look to him. I'm like, you wouldn't know anything. I just imagine a bird hit the window or something, you know? Yeah. He's like Arnold Schwarzenegger from True Lies. His job is just so boring. He's out yeah. of town all the time. And actually... <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. He's he does hang out in that same club with uh, the cigarette smoking man. I think he was there for job for Jack Ruby, right? Yeah. I don't know if he was there for leisure, yeah. necessarily. Well, he might have been going and, like, just watching. He might not have actually been as drunk as he says he was. Yeah. Well, we saw how Sissy reacted. How do we think that Ray and the cult is going to react? Well, I'm worried the way that Klaus came in. Like, Allison came in, like, I'm going to tell you everything. Klaus came in, he's like, Daddy's home. Yeah. You know, like, is he really gonna break the truth and say, like, I'm not a this or that? Or he doesn't feel he's first listening to Ben. Uh, yeah, I don't know. He might just kind of avoid it. Yeah. Tell that. I hope Ray gets on board. Yeah. Me too. I love Ray. I would love, I love Ray to too. Yeah. Count him as like a asset, as opposed to peripheral. Uh, there were some fantastic moments of cinematography in the episode, specifically the, uh, the spinning chair. Well, I like the spinning chair thing. That was awesome. But even just Diego and Luther walking down to eventually they get to the uh, car, like just the choices, the shots that they're doing. They one overhead the drone, shot that was interesting. They're doing a lot of like crane and movement and stuff. It's not just like running gun. All right, we have this scene. It's just walking down an alley and then getting in a car, which you could do much quicker, faster, cheaper. And not really change much, but they're going the extra effort, you know, for a lot of this stuff. Especially, like, the big sweeping shots inside the electronics, you know, to evoke this idea of this large house they kind of grew up in. But it's obviously not, but it is kind of like a coming together of the family. Mm -hmm. So, I just, they put a lot of effort into that stuff. And I really like the driver. It. Yeah, the driver. <laughs> <laughs> and we got to see the crazy hobo again. Out of that! Awesome! Oh, that guy comes back. This man needs a sandwich. <laughs> yeah. Oh man! He cut himself with the cheekbones. Yeah. Right. And then, uh, like, Aaron, I was kind of with you. I just forgot about the mannequin. Yeah, that I kind of forgot. Number about that. five used to bang. Did you forget about the mannequin? I don't. I, as soon as they said it, I was like, oh yeah, but it just didn't come to mind. Like, yeah. I love like, that. The hey, it, it didn't even like. <laughs> it didn't even cause a speed bump or anything for me because I watched yeah. it like. Yeah. Four days ago. But that emotional, like, goodbye he had, you know? Yeah. Like, and they shot it, didn't they? Yeah, I think so. Something like that. Yeah. No, he uh, he put it back and, like... He was hey, having a conversation with make it. Make sure you get some new clothes on yeah. that mannequin over oh, there. Oh, yeah, I guess that's true. Though we did have an action scene in that he came back later. Yeah. 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 So, anyway. All right, well, we'll see you guys next time. Thank you guys for watching this episode of the Umbrella Academy. You can see the next one right now over at patreon.com slash blindwave. Full length is there too. And Aaron is doing something very weird. I don't know, if you do this, it makes it look like it's wiggling. Right? Be sure to click subscribe so you never miss a video. Check out Twitter and all of our social media down in the description. It only works in real life. Bro. No, no.